Imagine being able to flip a switch and the world around you starts to change. Sounds like magic, right? But what if I tell you there's a method that promises just that, and it's simpler and more effective than you might think? I'm talking about the mirror principle, a fascinating approach that is gaining increasing importance in the world of self-improvement and personal growth. This principle is something very special. It's based on a simple yet profound idea. Our external reality is nothing but a reflection of our internal state. This means that the way we think about ourselves and our environment directly influences what we experience in our lives. It's as if we're painting the scenery of our lives with our thoughts and beliefs. But how exactly does this work? And what does it mean for you and me in everyday life? Let's dive together into this exciting world and find out how we can use the mirror principle to not only change ourselves, but also positively transform our surroundings. Now, the mirror principle is more than just a concept. Have you ever wondered why some people seem to glide effortlessly through life while others constantly swim against the current? And this is where the mirror principle comes into play. It's truly fascinating. And let me tell you, this principle is like a double-edged sword. On one side, it can draw us into a spiral of negativity, but on the other, it has the power to catapult us to the pinnacle of happiness and success. Imagine the mirror principle as a kind of magical mirror that shows not only what is, but also what could be. If we look into this mirror and see only problems, obstacles, and disappointments, then that's exactly what we manifest in our lives. It's like trapping ourselves in an endless loop of negativity. But here's the exciting part. If we use this mirror to reflect positivity, possibilities, and success, then our world starts to change. We open ourselves to new opportunities, attract positive experiences, and begin to realize our dreams. It's like resetting the sails of our life ship and steering towards a radiant horizon. The beauty of the mirror principle is that it gives us the power to be authors of our own story. We are no longer passive observers, but active creators of our reality. As we diving deeper into this phenomenon, let me explain how our inner self shapes the outer world. Imagine walking through a gallery full of mirrors, and each mirror shows you a different world. And that's exactly what happens in our lives through the mirror principle. Our external world is like these mirrors. It reflects what's going on inside us, our thoughts, feelings, beliefs. All these paint the picture we see in these mirrors. Now take Anna and Tom, for example. Both live in the same city, have similar jobs, but their worlds couldn't be more different. Anna sees the world as a place full of opportunities and adventures. She wakes up in the morning thinking, today is gonna be a great day. And guess what? Most of the time it is. Her positive attitude is reflected in her surroundings, in the opportunities she seizes and the people she meets. Tom, on the other hand, is the opposite. He often sees the world in a gloomy light and is convinced that luck is not on his side. This attitude is reflected in his reality, in missed opportunities and challenges that seem harder than they are. The fascinating thing is that Anna and Tom shape their realities through their inner attitudes. They live on the same planet, but in completely different worlds. And that's the true magic of the mirror principle. We have the power to choose the colors of our life's painting. Okay, we've talked about the mirror principle, but how do we apply it to manifest our dreams and goals? Well, the key to changing your world is conscious manifestation. It's like painting a picture. You stand in front of a blank canvas. That's your life. The question is, what do you want to paint on it? The first step is to realize that you are standing in front of this metaphorical mirror. You might see a picture you don't like. Maybe it's a job that doesn't fulfill you or a relationship that isn't what you want. But here's the catch. You don't have to focus on this picture. Instead, you can decide what you want to see in this mirror. Imagine what your ideal life looks like. Do you feel the joy, the excitement, the love? Hold on to these feelings. That's the key. You're painting with the colors of your thoughts and feelings. The more vividly and consistently you imagine your desired image, the faster the external world begins to reflect this image back to you. Now, we come to a point that is often overlooked but incredibly important, patient and consistency. Imagine you are planting a seed and you can't expect it to grow into a tree overnight, right? And the same goes for manifestation through the mirror principle. It is easy to become impatient, especially in a world that values quick results and instant gratification. 
But here is the truth. The really profound changes, the changes that turn our lives upside down, take time. They are like a work of art, slowly coming to life. Consistency is your best friend on this journey. It is about holding on to your desired state, even when the external world has not caught up yet. It is like applying a little more paint to your canvas each day, even if the picture is not complete yet. And then all of a sudden, you start to notice small changes. They might seem insignificant at first, just tiny things, but they are signs that something is moving. That moment is when you realize that your patience and consistency are starting to pay off. Remember, every great artist needs patience and trust to complete their masterpiece. And in this process of manifestation, you are the artist of your life. And the mirror principle teaches us that our external world is a direct reflection of our inner thoughts, feelings, and beliefs. If we want to change out lives, we need to start with our inner selves. And it is about consciously focusing on what we want to see in our lives and blocking out everything else. Thank you for embarking on this journey with me. If this video resonated with you, I invite you to like and subscribe to our channel. Share this video with others so they can benefit from this message. And don't forget to leave a comment below sharing your thoughts, reflections, and experiences. Thanks again for watching and for joining me. Take care and see you soon.